Oh. Yes, they did. <laughs> okay, guys, we're back in Skyrim, and I have. Got to thinking, maybe I'm the Dragonborn. That's and I just exactly don't what I was yet. thinking. Um, I thought, seeing as we're here, and I can't stand uh, the Imperials, I'm going to go and see um, Alfred. Alfred won't give us a straight answer. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. Don't be so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from Solitude. The Empire is putting a great deal of pressure. There's no glory in war. It's just something they tell soldiers so they'll risk their lives. Up with us. He's against us. He knows that. They all know that. How long are you going to wait? You think I need to send Volgroth a stronger message? If by message you mean shoving a sword through his gullet. Taking his city and leaving him in disgrace would make a more powerful statement, don't you think? So we're ready to start this war in earnest then? Soon. I still say you should take them all out like you did dead King Torig. Torig was merely a message to the other Yars. Whoever we replace them with will need the support of our army. We're ready when you are. Things hinge on White Run. If we can take the city without bloodshed, all the better. But if not, the people are behind you. <laughs> Many, I fear, still need convincing. Then let them die with their false kings. We've been soldiers a long time. We know the price of freedom. But people are still weighing things in their hearts. What's left of Skyrim to wager? They have families to think of. How many of their sons and daughters follow your banner? We are their families. Damned faithless Imperials. Tell me, Darmar, why do you fight for me? I'd follow you into the depths of oblivion. You know that. Why, though? Yes, but why do you fight? That's, if not for that's me. That's what I just said. Your hat is so cool. I'll die before elves dictate the fates of men. I hate elves. We're not one in this. I. I help. I hate elves. There's no glory in war. I hate elves. It's just something they tell soldiers so they'll risk their lives. I didn't mean to do that. They call me a war hero. I'm no hero. I fight for my soldier who didn't want to die. to pay the debts of an empire too weak to rule them. Yet brands them criminals for wanting to rule themselves. I fight so that all the fighting I've already done hasn't been for nothing. I fight because I must. Your words give voice to what we all feel, Ulfric. And that's why you will be High King. For today, words are enough. The Storm folks are finding victory across the land. No longer needed. I will gladly retire from the world. Mm. I'm not place. much of a strategist. Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all I say. We have a war if you have any news of the Western Holds, take it to Ulfric immediately. Okay, so I don't want to get too much into a mission yet. Darmar thinks we should double. Only the foolish or the courageous approach a Jarl without summons. Do I know you? Is that so? Uh, yes. You were with us in helping. Uh. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. Uh. Raylock's alive. I hope that's true. He's a damn good man, but he hasn't returned yet. So I'll need to wait for his account. For now, speak with Galmar. I'm always looking for able fighters. Not everyone can say they made it out of hell. Seems we're all branded villains these days. So long as your criminal past stays in the past. And you fight for me with honor and integrity. I no. welcome you into our ranks. I do not. I, but in the meantime, we have a war to plan. Okay. Terrible shame. What ha Need something? Who do, who do I I'll I take see? my leave then. I talk to you? Hmm. Helgen, eh? Huh? Oh. Ulfric told us quite the story. If you made it through all that, you're likely worth something to me. Mm -hmm. 
But first, tell me, why the Breton want to fight for Skyrim? Mm. Want to fight the Empire? Mm. Uh, yeah. uh, can't fault anyone for that. As long as you hate the Empire as much as I do, that I can work with. I do. They're bastards. Uh, I do want to join, but do I want to join yet? Mmm, decisions, decisions. Uh, yes, screw it. All right. But before I can put you to use, I need to know how much you can take. I have a little test for you. Oh, don't they always? That's what I like to hear. So long as you can back up those words with steel. Or I'm magic. sending you to Serpent Stone Island. If you survive, you pass. If you die, well, you weren't going to be much use to me anyway. <laughs> It's where men have tested their metal for ages. It's a strange rock formation built by the ancients. Something about that place attracts the ice raids. You kill an ice raid out there, and I'll have all the proof I need about you. We'll see about that, won't we? Um, right, okay, well, I s s sort of started a main storyline there, um, so. My heart goes out to Clan Shattershield, kin murder. Um, but, what's that? See, I've sort of got a couple of quests going already. Um, let me get in. Taking K, what mission is that? Uh, see, that's quite, that's like a big mission. That's like, oh no, it's not. It's just me being stupid. Um, uh, so, if I take that and that. Okay, so that's that mission. I don't know. I really don't know what mission I want to do next. Okay. I think I should probably do the um, the way of the voice because I, I am. A, oh no! Oh, but Jim. I am meant to be a Dragonborn, so technically I'm sure I should be doing... Th ...that quest, so... Seeing as we've been here, we'll take that, just gonna wander across to Iverstead. Ugh! And we'll go from there. Okay. Oh. Where is it? Mm. Oh god. No, no, no. Don't really want to fight a dragon right now. general direction we want to be going. If we end up fighting it, we end up fighting it. I'm, but I'm, I'm not in any rush to be fighting dragons. I think it's the last time I had a fight with dragons. I did not fare too well. 
Then we'll give her a little swim. Ooh, ooh bugs. Ooh. Can't get distracted by bugs. I will take. Okay, I hear a bear. On your face. Oh yeah. Oh, that was rubbish. Oh. oh well, this is helping not skill up my archery. Now. Right. Come back here, bear. Ivor said. Ooh, very cool. What's this place? Oh, flowers. What the? I don't quite know what this is. I'm sure it will all become apparent. Oh, need wheat. Wheat's always useful. It seems wheat. Eggs and wheat. Always useful. The Imperials think us all lawless beasts. I'm proof of their ignorance. Uh, okay, say. There's a K right there. Nope. Oh. Okay, there doesn't appear to be anyone around. There's Lydia. So now we're here, right, and there is a quest somewhere for when to drop some food off as we go up there. I know that quest is there because I've done it before. So just need to. Uh, if I were you, I'd keep away from the barrow on the east side of town. Taunted. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Cool. Mm, the Greybeards are a solitary lot. I don't think they've ever ventured outside their monastery. We get the occasional pilgrim passing through here on their way to the summit, but almost all of them have returned disappointed. Mm, more there there. ain't much more to tell. They're haunted, and you should stay away. Look, I've seen one of the spirits with my very own eyes. When it glared at me, I swear it burned right through my soul. Fortunately, they seem to be sticking to the barrow. I think they're guarding it. Certainly isn't helping my business any. Who'd want to rent a room anywhere near a haunted barrow? Hmm. If you think there's anything you can do, be my guest. Why not? About a year or two ago, some fella named Windelius came through. Said he was some kind of a treasure hunter. I warned him not to go in there, just like I warned you. Treasure? The next night we heard screams from the barrow. I'd love to know we where he got that, him gets that in cloth from. Uh. Your eyes open in the barrel. That's how they get you. What, if you walk around with your eyes open or with them closed? Okay, well. I know. Okay, let's. Let's wait. A couple of hours, a few hours, six hours, a couple of hours? Whatever. Now we just need to. I know there's a sp what what we class as a spussel man over here. 
Hello? I can't see you, Raider. I can't find you. Where are you hiding? Hide, 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 hide. Don't make me sad. The mountain will eat you. Watch the mountain. I heard a bear. I can't see a bear. Okay, let's go talk to uh, our special friend. Oh, Raider, Raider. Raider was here, then gone. Went to gather plants and never came home. No, no. Everyone looked and no one could find her. Wilhelm said she'll be back. Told Harvey not to worry. Raider will come back. With father, I said goodbye. With mother, I said goodbye. Raider leaves and Narfi can't say goodbye. Makes Narvi very, very sad. Narvi needs Raider to say goodbye. Okay. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Okay, he talks absolutely if fine you see there. Raider, tell her that Narvi misses her and you'll come home soon. Very soon. Soon. Soon like the moon. Soon, soon like the moon. That makes so much sense. Oh, I didn't really... Ching! Okay, yeah, the, the, there is... Oh, wow, there is definitely a guy here. Who you talk to before you go up the mountain. Staying safe, I hope. No. Oh, that's annoying. Because if I don't... If I don't find him now, then I'm... Oh, how frustrating. And you know there's a quest here, but you can't find the, the quest giver. Are you the quest giver? Oh, you're a traveler. You must have so much to tell about the world Whoa. outside this boring town. You got wonky eyes. The Greybeards are a strange bunch. I heard they lived their entire life without uttering a single word. Can you even imagine? Ah, oh, but it's so peaceful. I wish I could go with you. Oh. Daughter's driving me crazy. So forgive me if I'm a bit on edge. They call it the path to the monastery to 7,000 steps. How many? Can you imagine? I'm not certain if I could even make it to the top without collapsing from exhaustion. Uh, I'm sorry. 7,000. Get out of town as fast as you can. Nothing for anyone here. Keep your hands you must be side. another pilgrim on the way up to High Frostgar. No Whoa. other reason to pass through here. I look at the face, and then look at the boobs. Base. Never mind. It's frightening living below their monastery. Sometimes I swear I can hear strange noises rolling down from up there. It sounds like thunder, but there's never any rain. What do you make of that? Well, it stops now. Sure, leave. Everyone else does. 